Hi, I'm Chris Walker with Rio Products, and today I'd like to introduce the Elite Predator series of fly lines, which is my first choice for throwing big flies. It's a really wide-ranging series. It has a lot of line weights in it and also several sink tips. But the thing they all have in common is a profile which allows the angler to turn over a big, heavy, wind-resistant fly, but to do it smoothly as well. And the way we've achieved that is with short heads, 32 to 36 feet in length, uh, with relatively heavy weights. So by having that heavy head and kind of a compact length, you can carry those big flies with ease. Turning them over smoothly comes down to having the taper uh, bias towards the rear of the head. So most of the weight is concentrated at the back of the head, and that allows you to turn those flies over with a little bit more precision and accuracy. The one other interesting feature of the tapers in these lines is that the head lengths change throughout the series. And it may sound a little counterintuitive, but those heads actually get shorter as the line weights get higher. And the reason we've done that is those biggest line weights, those 10s and 11s, are meant to throw the absolute biggest flies out there, stuff that's typical of pike and musky fishing. So by making the head just a little shorter, we are keeping that mass more concentrated, close to the fly and those flies can be turned over uh, more easily because that head is shorter. So in addition to the sort of interesting and unique taper of these fly lines, they come in a huge range of densities for sink tips. But one feature that all the sink tips have in common is what we call multi-density control. And all that means is we change the density progressively along the length of the line. So for example, I've got an FIS3 coil in my hand here, and you can see the tip of the line at the center of the coil here is that dark color, that's the type three. Then there's a gray intermediate section behind that, and at the back of the line, of course, is your floating density. So that's a nice feature because you change density slowly and sort of progressively throughout the length of the line. And that contributes to a more smooth casting line, and it also keeps the line in a, a straighter path between you and the fly as you retrieve the fly throughout your cast. Uh, that's kind of nice because if you have a really low density, so a floating line and a really fast sinking density like a type 7, if there's, there's no step down in density between the two, you get kind of a big belly between you and the fly. So if the fish were to eat and you strip, there's a lot of slack to be taken out. With that multi-density control, the line is in a straighter path, you get a much better hook set, and you can feel what's going on with your fly at the end of your cast much more easily. So as I said, there's a wide range of sink rates on these lines. The first is a full floater. That's pretty self-explanatory. The next is the FHI, which is short for Float Hover Intermediate. So this will keep your flies running just subsurface. Next after that, I already showed you the FIS3, which is gonna get your fly just a little bit deeper still, call it three to four feet down. And last but not least, we have our fastest sinking density, which is FS5S7. So the tip of this line actually sinks at about seven inches per second, and that'll really dig your fly in. You can fish, you know, eight to 10 feet down, depending on how long you let that fly sink. Now, each of those uh, sink rates and each of those sink tips have a similar configuration in that the sinking sections are each 10 feet long. So for example, on that FS5S7, you've got 10 feet of type seven, 10 feet of type five, and then floating line behind that. So each of these sink tips in total has a 20 foot sinking section. Next, all of these lines are built on our top tier core encoding technologies. So the core is our Connect Core Plus material, which is braided and that allows it to be very supple even in cold conditions. Uh, and that core is also 30% uh, lower stretch than a standard fly line core. And that's a big advantage when you need to strip set a fly into the hard bony mouth of a big fish. So if I were to set the hook by stripping and my fly line stretched 30% more, I have to move my hand 30% farther in order to get the same hook set force. So that low stretch core is a huge advantage when you're setting the hook. These are also built with our slick cast coating technology, which creates the most durable and slick coating on the market. So these lines will perform at a very, very high level for many, many trips. So if you like throwing big flies in cool to moderate conditions, check out the Elite Predator series online at rioproducts.com or at your local Rio dealer. Thanks.